<clears throat> okay, Akumaldo Crypto here with another Bitcoin update. So I would like to start, guys, uh, by showing you uh, what is to be a trader for me. Okay, I have this guy here as a whole model, Peter Brand. Um, sorry to be mentioning you here, but you are amazing. Over my 40, 43 years of trading, I have made 100% of my profits in about 15% of my trades in an average of about three to four months each year. That's what I need. That's what I want for me, guys. I don't want to be here for one year alone. I want to be here for 43 years. Yeah, if you want to be a trader that is only what? Uh, focusing on the short term you you're probably gonna be broken in one year okay that's that's the statistics Wall Street is paved with bodies of people trying to do this exact same thing so if you are showing off if you're bragging about your your uh, gains and everything I'm gonna tell you guys, <laughs> this is not news. Wall Street have been doing, uh, Wall Street guys have been doing the same for a long time. And I'm gonna tell you, based on the books that I've read, that they have mentioned in my channel, okay, those books like uh, Food by Randomness, just one, I think, uh, just one, uh, uh, just one example. You're gonna see that <laughs> chance plays a huge role in what we are doing here, okay? So don't, guys, don't. It, it's 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 important to not be fooled by guys showing off, bragging, and um, buying expensive things and buying Lambos. I'm not a, I'm not this kind of trader, okay? My TA is a. Uh, 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 my TA is a educational and an intellectual thing. Okay, trading is another part of the thing. Trading is a different thing. Trading, we have different styles. We have day traders, swing traders, and ear traders. Okay, investors. We have different kinds of uh, personality that you need to adjust to the type of uh, investor in. Uh, trader that you are okay and uh, but one thing though that I would like to say is never never be impressed by someone else that is buying things and showing off because this is the kind of the behavior that is exactly signaling the opposite okay the opposite not if you say that you have a lot of money is because you don't have if you use expensive clothes, it's because you are broken. Okay, millionaires don't use. Look at Elon Musk. Look at Bill Gates. Uh, look at Warren Buffett. You, you have plenty of examples of people that are really successful. Look at them. Okay, simple. Um, so let's now jump into Bitcoin. Uh, nothing has happened uh, we are still trying to this is the second day we are trying to break this blue line of resistance here okay and again we try to, we touched it we failed okay and the daily chart we are 264 days correcting okay and we have this target here down okay the 4k 3k we are down forming this first wave okay i'm proposing this first wave uh, i think it would be better if i show you guys the daily chart remember i, I had a channel here okay a channel a fib channel but now this channel is broken totally broken we broke below this trend line this blue dotted line here that i it has act as a support here and a resistance and now it's acting as a resistance i proposed yesterday that we were we we would uh linger a little bit around this region and guess what we are 
in this region. Yes, we would take some time because this is the characteristic of a wave four. That's why I'm thinking this. This that, that this is why I'm thinking. This is why I said this is, was a wave three. It is a wave three, my opinion. And now we are correcting for wave four. Are we gonna touch the fifty percent here as I proposed? Okay, this is the fifty percent, six 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 hundred or six five hundred for the thirty eight twenty percent. We don't know. We haven't touched the thirty eight twenty percent. Okay, uh, because the because of the alternation rule. Wave 2 is such a shallow wave, so we expect wave 4 to be complex and uh, it takes more time. So I, I can see something like a, an A, perhaps a B here and a C here. Perhaps it is difficult to make sense of this now. Let me see 30. Yeah, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. This would be a B information we might have a expanded flat a B that goes deeper here okay we might have something like this a and a flat B here a flat correction okay but it this is another story uh, this is, we need data in order to confirm that okay that's pretty much the story that this is that's pretty much what we have at hand we are waiting for this correction here nothing else okay nothing else uh, we it's gonna be difficult for bitcoin to recover from this dump because we have all those resistance not this is not something that institutional money can't do because if the if the bigger if the whales want want Bitcoin to go up it's gonna be well it's gonna go up okay because it's, it's such a lot of money but for us we are normal per, normal people I think <laughs> normal people in in the in the I'm sorry I lost my train of thoughts <laughs> uh, we are normal people in the sense that we don't have such a, a large portfolio at least I don't so we can't move Bitcoin, okay? We just can ride it and kind of give a polite guess where it's going, okay? Using our framework, our Elliott Wave principle in this case. And nothing pretty significantly has changed, okay? We need to wait for this wave for here that might go to the 30, 20%, might go to the 50%, okay? Wait and see. I marked this, 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 uh, yeah, white line here. I marked as a temporary support because we try it. This is 30 minutes. Let me put one hour again. And I mark it because we tried to break. This was like, like what? This was uh, 63061. Okay. This is kind of a line of resistance of a support. I'm sorry. Okay. So. Bitcoin is tr has tried m several times to break, okay, and then we had a pullback. Hmm. It remains to be seen what's gonna happen, right? It remains to be seen. The fifth channel here was, has been broken. It's not gonna go back. It's a clear motive impulse wave down, and we need to finish it. It's not finished yet, okay? And that's it. Uh, uh, there is nothing else I can say uh, other show you guys the weekly chart the weekly chart we see this huge bearish candle as I said yesterday this bearish candle we touched the the blue line here this blue line that has act as a support and it's every time that we touch it we bounced okay it was not the it, it wouldn't be different um, are we gonna touch the 100 EMA? Here we have the 100 EMA. Okay, the 100 EMA have this 100 EMA here has never been touched. So until now, right? I think that it must be touched. It must be tested. This is not such a, a deep 100 EMA. If we think that's 5800, so a lot of analysts, <coughs> me included 
has put a line here okay this is an important line to let me put in yellow this is an important line 5800 this is gonna be a support okay it's gonna be a strong support when we touch it we're gonna we're gonna have some kind of uh, reaction okay but we have it here as, as well see this third target okay again all those targets I derived from fib pools okay from all the targets so it's not it, if you want to know a little bit more you need to go and take a look at my previous videos and I think not the last one but the the previous one before the last one <laughs> I think I talked about how to pull fibs and uh, and to get those algo targets here we have an algo target here at the 5500 okay this is from the whole pool okay from this whole movement here okay so I think that's enough for today uh, we don't have a lot to say so um, as always, if you enjoy my content, if you like it, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. Uh, don't forget, I have a Patreon. Uh, if you haven't followed me on Twitter, please consider doing so. You have Crypto Trader Educational Institute. This is my, my Discord channel. You have the link in the description. Okay. Thank you very much for watching and I see you guys next one. Cheers.